Hey everybody and welcome back to Terraria. When we last left off, we were down deep in the mines. And by the mines, I mean uh, accidental antline nest area. And I'm going to give up on that for now. We'll come back later when we're a little bit stronger. For now, what we're going to do is we're actually going to do some mining. Uh, so I'm on the lookout primarily for platinum to make us a pickaxe. Any copper or iron or whatever I see on mine up as well. Maybe make a full suit of armor. But I really want to get a better pick because the sooner we can mine quicker, the better. I don't want to fight this slime. Stupid purple slime. Uh, so the best way to find platinum is to go deep. And the best way to get deep is to go the way we've already been and set up with rope and stuff. Also, there is an area that I would want to put some rope on here to stop me from taking fall damage every single time I freaking do it. Even though it's not vitally important. Also, I'm getting more used to the um, zoom out now. Uh, you know, just... No! No, please! I wasn't even coming to you guys! One heart already. Better stay with. Don't you do it. Where are you? You come back. You come back. I'll get you. You think about coming back up here. I'll get you again. Is he gone? What is that on my map? Oh, no, wait. He's going. Up here, look. Why is that glowing? Ah, freaking. It's camping me. It knows I can't leave. Right, I'm going to make a run for it in a second. Go. Keep going. Oh, no. We're fine. Uh, Let's go this way. We haven't been this way, and it's away from the antlion nest, and hopefully away from everything dangerous. <gasps> There's a crystal heart. That's excellent for us, although it does mean we can't use it yet. Because we are not ready to fight bosses. We are no... <gasps> Bag of money! Excellent. Excellent. Hear something splashing in the water trying to get to me. You know what? I am going to do this. This is a bit of a pain. Oh my god, no. No, oh, they do so much damage. They do so much damage. 88. And he took my money, I saw him. I saw him just take my money. Oh, the worst part about this is it's so far away to get back to the drop down point. Actually, you know, we've got so much stuff, let's put some of this stuff away. Getting over there is so annoying, but it's the quickest way rather than just digging down. Alright, first of all, quick stack. Second of all, uh, put this stuff away, please. Uh, yeah, that's right. This is these things. Is cobweb in here? Where do I keep cobweb? I have potions, don't need these. This is a bottle of locks. Get rid of those. This is ores and stuff. What's this? Marble! Ooh. Where do I keep my cobwebs? Like, for real, though? Oh, in here. Okay. I got a marble block. Marble block. Right, let's go. I'm ready for this. So, one of the things we can do is use bomb. 
Use bombs to mine up things that our pickaxe cannot yet do. So I could potentially do it in the antline area and see what that stuff is. And I was going to do it on that crimson ore. To get the crimson ore. Then I kind of changed my mind because then I was like, you know, it's only two, two pieces of ore. What does that even get me? Nothing. Um, but... Then the hoplite showed up. I want to kill a hoplite. Because maybe they have something good for me. But at the same time... 88 damage. If I'm at full health, the third hit will kill me. Two hits will reduce me to only 4 HP. That's how tough that is. Right, tell you what, I'm going to bomb the antline area. If that's like some really good ore... That we can actually make stuff out of. That's, that'll be amazing. Absolutely fantastic. Uh, if it's not, then hey, you know we have some stuff that we're going to learn about. Where was it? Where even was it? It was somewhere that I couldn't mine. Is that it next to the house? I don't remember. Let's just drop in and look. Yeah, it's this stuff over here. Oh, crap. Haha, -ha, get duped, son. Get duped. It was this stuff right here. Bit of lag, maybe touched the wrong thing. So let's put a bomb there. Oh, crap. Bomb doesn't mine it. Oh, this is even tougher. Even tougher stuff. No. Huh. No. Okay, alright, we've got it trapped. Now we're getting killed by a freaking butt! Okay, here we go. What was that little golden thing? Oh, no, we're dead. We, we're dead. What is that golden man down there? Man, whatever that... That's, that can't be an ore. An ore. That has to be... Giant Shelly? Uh, there can't be an ore that has to be something like. Uh, we've already had compacted sand. What could it be? Like. Oh, I can't think of the name of it. You know when, like, wasps, and I guess antlions maybe, um, like, harvest materials and then form a hive out of it? Not the hive, not like hive blocks, but they make a material of their own with, like, their own saliva and stuff. Maybe it's like that, and maybe it's just a building material, like a blast-resistant building material. I don't know. Right, we're, forget it anyway. We're not going anywhere near it. I had my one check, and then I died. We're going to go down. We're going to start digging. Um, any hoplites show up, we might maybe try to cheese them. If we can, like, build a wall to keep them out and then throw a boomerang at them, or bombs. Ooh, bombs would be a good idea. I'm hoping, like, maybe they have a chance to drop, like, hoplite armor. And then uh, maybe we can wear that. Or maybe even drop their javelin weapon. That'd be cool. That seems pretty powerful. Why'd I do that? I knew I put a rope there for a reason. I had a rope for... Jump off! Crap. I didn't mean that far. <gasps> a snowman! Is that... Salamander! You sound pretty tough. That's right, you live down there, and what I'm going to do is I'm going to put a rope here, look. Connected from this. And then uh, I'm going to sit on this rope, like this. No! You stupid skeleton! And I'm going to throw things at you until you die. Like this, look. Yeah, you, you quack at me, you salamander. Salamanders don't quack, you're not a duck. You're not a penguin. Also, salamanders don't walk upright. Freaking bat. Cost is gonna be a bat. Cost is gonna be a bat nearly killing me. Trick a freaking potion so I don't die. Come on. Why'd that skeleton have to join into the fun? I didn't want to fight a skeleton. Oh, well, if it drops a hook and I get a grappling hook already, that'd be amazing. Now, he doesn't drop the grappling hook, he drops the hook to craft it. But we could easily craft it, I think, given a fight. Well, you dropped me Salamandor. 
Oh boy. A ruby. No, it's just salamander guts. The guts of a salamander. I'm going to mine this. Get away from me, please. I'm not going to die to a freaking cave bat. Oh no, there's a centurion coming. Right, I can safely drop down. But can I safely get back up? There's a Roman centurion coming. No, I can. Okay. No, get on, get on the rope. It's fine. This is fine. This is fine. There's a sunken ship. I always call it a sunken ship. It's not just a sunken ship. It's called something else entirely. No. No. He <laughs> used my cheese strategy. There's a chest in there. Right. I always call these sunken ships. And I don't know why. Probably because it's like they're usually surrounded by water. I don't know. But they're like underground cabins or mining cabins or something. But right there. Look. That's a piranha statue and a golden chest. Piranha statues are valuable. Just like rabbit statues are. And the gold chest could have anything in it. And we've already set up a system there. So what I was hoping was that the hoplite would jump down to try and get me. And then while he was down below, I could throw my boomerang at him. Well, that is occurring to me now that that wouldn't work since he's got freaking javelins that he could throw into my brain. So, how am I going to kill a centurion? I've got to get one underneath me somehow. And then I've got to drop bombs on him while not getting hit. So like over a ledge maybe? Or maybe build a wall and throw bombs over the wall. Hopefully I don't destroy the wall that I've built. I don't know. I don't know. I'm sick of coming down here. I should build a freaking railway. I really should build a railway to get down here. Okay, right, let's not take fall damage every single step of the way this time. Come on. There we go. Drop snail. No! I'm fine. Blood moon! Oh, this is going to be bad for me. This is going to be very bad for me. <laughs> this is not going to go well. I'm stuck. Am I not stuck? I was just being stupid. No. No. No! Come on. Did it. Did it. I did it. I did it. That's fine. That's fine. Please. Go, webs. Please. Get the HP. Loot the chest. Chest is... Okay, we've got an, acces uh, an accessory. Loot all. Mind that. Mind that. Mind that. Destroy this stuff. Hey, you know what? What does it matter? Get out. What does it matter if there's a blood moon if, we, if we're underground? It doesn't matter, does it? Get away, get away, get away, get away. Did that worm just climb down my rope? Because I think it did. I think it only did. Also, if we warp home, I need to remember that they can knock, knock down doors. Wait, can't piranhas also drop hooks? What can you do? Piranha out of water, eh? Piranha out of water. Fish out of water. Don't you do it. Don't you do it. Don't you do it. Right, there are what well, appear to be topazes here. I was incorrect. There are no topazes here. I really think my only choice is to go up and face the Blood Moon. Unless there's something you know, I can do over here. But I don't know. Okay, let's go. Let's carefully go. Every time I hear a single noise, it freaks me out. It's not going to be good for me, is it? Is that a cabin? It's a cabin! I see a cabin! Okay, uh... Rope. I want to go up. Fine, go down. I want to go up. See the cabin? I'll peel it. 
I'm making some rigging to get myself across. Look at this. I found one. Lag. Lovely. So I wanted. Okay, 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 okay. Found we got. Ooh, brand of regeneration plus stuff. Loot all. Take chest. I heard someone touch a switch. First of all, do that and that. We've got some dynamite as well. How do I get out? Trapped. There we go. No, why'd you go? <laughs> Freaking these bats are too agile. Get out. I'm here for all. Well, you know what? We could get slush now and try to extract it. Some nice ore. There's another freaking hoplite down there. No, he's coming up. You know what, Hoplite? Yeah, you better walk away because you know what was going to happen. Ah! <laughs> oh no, I'm going to start outside surrounded by stuff. Oh, and they can break down the door to get into my house. Oh, this is not good. Okay, right. No, there's a zombie right there. Huh! Juked him. Right, we need to get this one block. No! Why does it do that? Why does it... No! I hate the fact that it automatically opens up. No, please. You don't understand. No! Get out! Blood monsters! Oh, this is pretty freaking awful right now. A dribbler. That sounds gross. That zombie has a pink slime on its head. So that block, I tried to place it in front of the door so the enemies couldn't get in. Uh, but I got knocked back as I was placing it. So now, my only chance is to mine up said block and replace said block. Hopefully while no zombies are in my house. Okay, right. Well, I'm going to die. But you know what? I'm okay with it. Get out, please. Please get out of my house. You're not welcome. Okay, that's fine. Honestly, it is now fine because it means we can actually block our entrance now. Oh, they got in. Please don't be in my house. If I can just block one door, that's all I need. Is to block one door. So there are new uh, Blood Moon enemies. That's cool. All the more reason for me to actually set up a base that I spawn in. Don't really, really, you're gonna do that to me? Spawn camp me? Is this what my life is gonna be like now? Just getting spawn camped? Did you see those freaking moves? I've put it in the wrong... No, I did put it... It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. I can't even get in my own door. My door wouldn't open. Right, you get out. I'm okay with this. Look, they can't get in my house. I'm safe. Whew. Right now, if you guys want to come around the back and fight, I'm all for it. I'm all down. Alright, I found uh, a big problem with my climbing claws. I'm going to have to... Oh no! How did that happen? How did that happen? <laughs> How did I manage to run out but not back in? Anyway, the big glitch with my... Oh, glitch. Is it a glitch or is it just an issue? Um, with my climbing claws is that I cannot open doors anymore. Because I tried to climb them instead. I... 
when there are like eight enemies on top of me, I'm not going anywhere. Was my first Blood Moon this bad? I seem to remember my first Blood Moon being an issue. Maybe it was a self caused issue because I think I had a base at that point. I don't know. Whatever, right, I'm gonna fight my way through this Blood Moon. I need to keep, keep making progress in this direction. Gonna do it, gonna do it. Okay, right, we did. This dribbler sounds absolutely disgusting. It grosses me out. That's right, you can all live down there. That's right, you can all live down there. What's it like living down there? Don't you swing at me. This is fine. This is fine, this is progress. This is progress. It might not look like it, but trust me, it is. Because now we go, yeah, ha -cha. And this is where we make our move, because they're all going to drop down on us in a second. There we go, look. We'll fight them on the beaches. We'll fight them in our back cave. That zombie, oh, it's two zombies. <laughs> I thought he had a really cool cape on him, like a purple cape, but it's the pink-headed zombie behind him. Oh, hey, it's, um, it's over. You guys can maybe, like, leave my house? That dribbler thinks he can get away, and it's not. That dribbler ain't going nowhere. You started this war. You don't start fights that you can't finish. You come back here. Purple slime, please. Don't do this. You. No, come here, dribbler. Come here, dribbler. I'll catch you. I'm gonna catch you. Gonna, gonna beat you up, Dribbler. I need to overtake. Yeah. There we go. I'm on this side now. Get over there. Get back over there. You bring the fight to my house. That is what you get. You do not get away with that nonsense. Freaking, how many times did I die? How many gravestones do I have to go and collect? I didn't even get anything cool for doing that. Well, I've got a black lens, actually, so... I'll take it back. If I get one more black lens, I can make a cool pair of sunglasses. But I won't. But I won't. Right, time to get back in our house. I feel like we've made no progress. <laughs> Look, I can't go in my door. It's these stupid climbing claws. I need to unequip them. Uh, how do I... Unequip. It is square! Wait, crap. Crap! Crap! Hang on, hang on. I I've got a, a numerous issues at the moment. First of all, what the hell are you doing in my house? Get out of my house. Get out. Get out. Get out. Thank you. Second of all, get out. You wanna come in? Guess what? You can't. Get out. Right. Was it my climbing claws? Or was it the fact that there was a grave behind my door? Let's re-equip the climbing claws with freaking L2 to equip, but square to unequip. That's why I had square on the brain. Right, okay, climbing claws will let me open doors. That's fine. Let's remove this. Don't do it, slime. Don't freaking even think about it, slime. Right, it's a... Put so much stuff. Wait, what did I get? Did I get anything good? Go bind of regeneration, uh whatever. Whatever. Building materials. I really don't like this thing of when I leave my inventory and it then it reopens my inventory to show me what's in a nearby chest. I don't like that. Is there a way to turn it off? You guys let me know. Cause honestly, I freaking hate it. Uh I don't have anything for that. And now we need more chests. Of course we need more chests. We're always going to be needing more chests. It can go out here. It's my chest of non-importance. Stuff that I can get robbed and I wouldn't bat an eyelid. Right, 
I think it's time to end the video. But, again, we've made no progress. All I wanted to do was go mining. Here's what I'm going to do. Don't you even start with me, slime. Here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to get some slush. And we're going to extractinate that slush. And maybe, just maybe, we will get uh, something good. Oh, you know, maybe not. Maybe we'll get crap. Maybe we'll get a pet. Maybe we get some diamonds. Oh, I don't want to build some crappy little houses just to move people in, but I don't want to build like proper houses yet. Hmm. I'm not sure. Uh, today, by the way, I'm recording this video on Thursday. Still. So this will be episode 8, I think. And I think this is going to be the last one I record for a few days, because I want to let you catch... Oh, wait, no, hang on. What day is it? If it's Thursday, for Friday 5, Saturday 6, Sunday 7, Monday 8. Yeah, it's fine. I'm going to say because uh, the weekend, I think I'm not going to be able to do any recording. So it's like, I need to make sure I've got some something for the weekend anyway. But I do, so that's all well and good. Cool, full damage, perfect. Drop down here. Drop down here. How, is there a way to get off? Oh, it's just X. And the best. And the freaking best this game. Oh, climbing claws! I forgot how good they were. Ooh, what is it there? I don't care, I don't care. We're going as deep as we can. To get as much stuff as we can. Is a freaking hoplite coming for me? I'm not even going to think about fighting him until I kill his bat. Right, there he is, look, down there. You see that? This is the perfect opportunity to kill him. Because now he's going to be trapped in the hole, look. Or he's going to come back over here. We're going to drop that down there. Perfect, perfect. This time when he tries to leave. Perfect. Oh, okay, okay. That got him. Oh, go this way. No! Right, he's in the hole. He's in the hole. Oh, wait. Oh, oh you evaded it. It's got to be. No, he jumped over it again. And they... This guy has more... Sc There's a freaking cab in here. How? Look at the water draining effects. I didn't know that was a thing. Oh, you know what? I've got, I've got so many bombs. Come over here. No, like... That's fine. Just stay down there. We'll get you. I'll get you eventually. <laughs> I'll get you eventually. We got him. Did he drop anything? He did. He dropped javelins. More than one. Which is confusing to me. Oh, cool. <gasps> yes! Boots of freaking moveness. And he equipped them. And then I'm going to mine up this. Oh, we've got boots that allow me to move fast. Also, got some graves I want to get rid of. And 43 javelins. Oh, so it's, it's a throwing item. Okay, I see. I see. I like the water effects. What is Giant Shelly? I need to. I need to kill Giant Shelly. I need to go and kill Giant Shelly. It has to be done. No, where'd he go? Yeah! 
Giant Shelly is tough. You know what's tougher? You know what's tougher than Giant Shelly? Oh my god. Beautiful. Also, it wasn't tougher than Giant Shelly because she survived. No! Giant Shelly, please. Don't leave me. I've come so far. We did it. Why oh, is all that HP of it? Oh. Hey, Hoplite, drop down that hole. No? Fine. Fine, you don't need to drop down that hole. Ooh, you know what we could do? You know what we could do is... Go like this, and then... Can I mine from here? I can. No! 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 Well, that is going to do it for today. Thank you for watching. Tune in next time. Uh, I don't know what. You guys will have left me loads of comments telling me what I need to do to progress. And while I do know what I need to do to progress, I need some direction. There are so many things I could do, and there are so many things that I'm not doing that I feel like you guys could really help me out. Right, I'm going to quick start this stuff away. And I'm going to say thank you for watching. Tune in. Tune in next time when we... Oh, God. Put a chest in front of the door so I can't open the door. Tune in next time when I do some stuff. I don't know. For now, though, goodbye.